Good morning friends. This is the daily morning podcast. Today it is 18th of June. I am Devarsh from HDFC Securities. Markets could open mildly lower in line with other Asian markets. US stocks slump in the final hour of trade on Wednesday to end three days of gain as investors pass the second day of congressional testimony by Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell in which he underscores the lasting toll of the pandemic. Powell also said some form of unemployment insurance should continue past the expiration date of July 31st. In US economic news, housing starts rose 4.3% in May to an annualized pace of 9,74,000 from a five-year low of 9,34,000. New Zealand's GDP fell 1.6% in the March quarter, the largest drop in 29 years and the first quarterly fall since December 2010 as the effects of COVID-19 restrictions sap the economic activities. Back home, India's textile and apparel exports declined by staggering 73% in April to May due to closure of factories and problems of shipments. Anil Ambani's Reliance Infrastructure has initiated negotiations with Torrent Power to sell its 51% stake in each of the two Delhi distribution companies. Muthut Finance, Cummins India, Natco Pharma, FDC, Indraprasth Gas, JK Cement, Fidelite, REC are some of the important results announced yesterday. Do read more about them in our morning note, The Daily. Indian markets ended marginally lower in the range-bound trade yesterday amid mildly negative global queues and Indochina tensions. Technically, the Nifty's high-low range is slowly becoming narrower. Any breakout out of the 9720 to 10046 band could lead to an acceleration of movement in that direction. Thank you for listening in. Have a profit.